Yeah, well, back in 2017, Smithfield had committed to removing from its supply chain this torturous device called a gestation crate. Two foot, two foot by seven foot metal cage the mother pig is trapped in her entire adult life. We suspected that they had not actually done that. The government and the industry had not been responsive to any of our trees. We've gone to Costco many times, one of Smithfield's big buyers, and said, hey, we're concerned about your supply chain. They'd done absolutely nothing. So we went on ourselves, documented what we saw, guess what we found, gestation crates. And we also saw two dying piglets collapsed on the ground, in one case, or actually quite sickly, inside that factory. And for taking these two piglets to a vet and bringing them to an animal rescue, we're now facing very serious criminal charges that could lead to up to 10 years in prison. A really important factor is just the fact that Smithfield Foods slash WH Group was able to mobilize the FBI to come after these two piglets. Anybody watching this, if you ever find yourself missing $100 or $50 worth of some good or whatever, try calling the FBI and see if they'll go on a multi-state chase to get back to your quarter of property. Yeah. They won't do it. But because of the ties and the power that Smithfield Foods has and the influence it has over the federal government, the state governments, and the states that it operates in, it's able to do these things that are just frankly disgusting. Yeah. Power is this weird, corrupting effect of the law. Yeah. Like when this incredible power comes into contact with the law, it's almost like the law is like twisted and distorted. You can see it like being reshaped by this huge corporation.